Hello researchers, good day. This is Ms. John. Welcome to Practical Research 1 with me. And for today's video, we are going to cover um, on uh, APA 7th edition and citation guidelines. Now, I let you watch a video, right, um, of, from Smart Student, and the title was about in text citation. Now, let's get ahead and discuss briefly on what are the important parts of that you should rem that you should remember in in text citation now what is apa right so why are you using this so apa stands for american psychological association that's a p a and it's an organization in america and why do we uh, use this kind of citation so if you notice um it is the citation style used in most of the social sciences as well as some of the natural sciences. Okay, and the nature of our research for practical research one is that we are going to um, conduct our research to uh, further explore human behavior. Okay, and the human the humanity. So that's why social science is. Therefore, that is the best citation that we should use. It's APA, okay? And with that being said, uh, let's get ahead and have in-text citation, right? We have in-text citation 1, and we also have reference list citation, the reference list, right? This is another citation. What is the difference between the two? When you say in-text citation, right? From the word in-text, uh, these citations can be found inside the body of text of the research paper. When you say reference list or reference citation, this will be found at the end of your paper. So, for example, I have here a research paper. This is a research journal. And when you look at the paper, right, um... Adults, uh, adults report the fear of public speaking more than any other fear, including death. That's from Dwyer and Davidson of 2012. So, besides, the Dwyer and Davidson in this particular paper. Since it's found inside the text, this is now your in-text citation. So, Dwyer and Davidson. This is in-text citation. Let's see. Where is the reference citation of Dwyer and Davidson? Mm -hmm. So, the references list. This is the references list sat citation. And then, Dwyer, there. Naasila. Dwyer and Davidson. Okay? Um, public speaking, really more than fear than death. And, oh. So, hey. Sige, click na ako and then uh, I was routed to that. No? So, that is it. Not the in-text citation is found inside the text. Mm, and there's a reference citation. There is just a references list at the end of the paper. So, it's That means, so miss, whatever we cite in the text, like here inside the text, dapat naasad siya sa inyong references list. Very good observation and that is correct. So, dapat mo match ang unsay references list din he to the in-text citation in your paper. Mm, okay. Now, why do we need to cite? Okay, we need to cite in order to, um, in order for you, okay, to give credits to the rightful owner at the same time to really identify which, you know, is your own idea versus um, the idea of other authors. And the very most important, right, um, function of citation is for you to avoid plagiarism. No, plagiarism is the intentional or unintentional stealing of someone else's ideas so for example adults report the fear of public speaking more than any other fear including death that's what you wrote you did not cite dwyer and davidson okay that goes to show this idea or this um claim no you claim that as your own emotion gyang kon kay wala man ka nagcite og anyone that's what will happen okay and in research that is a very big no 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 you cannot do that you have to cite really who's the rightful owner of the ideas mentioned in your paper okay 
and um, also there's a law if you um, plagiarize you can be sued no um, because it um, you are violating the um, intellectual property of a person okay so again you have to cite 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 now that's it okay so we already had this is index citation and this is references list uh, citation there okay let's talk about index citation first unsan na index citation we have two types parenthetical and narrative citations what's parenthetical parenthetical is when you write the citation inside parentheses that's a parenthetical shot what's narrative citation only the date is in the parenthesis and the author or authors are part of the narrative you know, part of the sentence okay let's have an example in parenthetical this is what will happen no parenthesis are necessary in developing okay de la cruz 2019 Na siya sa parenthesis. And usually found ang parenthetical at the end. Okay? But make sure parenthetical na siya and then na-i period din ha because this is still part of the sentence. No? Meaning, ang nisulti, ang kaning idea is from De La Cruz 2019. How does narrative go? So, De La Cruz stated that parenting styles are necessary in developing the character of real children. So, that's De La Cruz 2019. Or pretty said, according to the Lacus 2019, parenting styles are necessary in developing the character of young children. Okay? So, pwede duha, no? Ang kuan. Basta sa narrative, gani appeal ang thought, no? Ang, the last name of the author or authors are part of the sentence. That's it. Okay? And then you have there, if one author, last name, comma, um, de, uh, year, Okay, so last name and then year na as a parenthesis. And then if two authors, again, open parenthesis, um, last name and then ampersand, and then another last name, comma, and then year. Okay? Uh, ampersand na siya, no? Basta na as a parenthetical citations. You use ampersand. Basta duha. If two authors, if narrative, ago eh. Part man siya sa imuhang statement or sentence. Of course, you have to spell it out. A and D and and three or more three four five and up so you use at all et space al dot na she dot din ha kung say meaning sa at all at is and al is others and others at all with a period after all at all and others okay and then that's how you do for group author um i don't really encourage you guys to have unknown authors kay it will really impact um, the credibility of the paper. So, please, let's avoid, no? Um, having unknown authors as well. Let's, let's avoid as much as possible having no dates. But if, um, Miss Wala na Jila and Miss, and then no date should see, uh, um, siguro, uh, I can accept. But in uh, in extreme cases, sa good kay niyang ND, as well as ang no title. Because journals, uh, published works, na agid na author na ID. All right. And um, you use source locator if you what? Yes, very good. If you directly quote, uh, you know, from a certain person or a, from a uh, from a source and from the paper. Example. So Kanisha, so this happiness that good relationships. Kanisha, is you really directly quoted kung unsig ni Waldinger of 2016? Okay. Or the ang um, unsigisol ni Brown, adaptability is about vulnerability, okay? And if if um kanang if it's a, a book or a, an online um journal, it just said that the parenting styles in develop na okay from the La Cruz to sa nineteen and then page sa na siyang page dito sa journal, okay na ake open and na ake quotation marks, meaning mo na siya dito yung gisulti sa author. In, in in research really we um discourage no the use of mga direct quotations kay the more magsigil ka quote 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 direct quote ibutang ni mo um your paper will have a high chance of um not your original work okay so mas maayo that you what you paraphrase okay so uh 
by this time, no, that uh, in you're already in grade 11, you already know the essentials of paraphrasing. Okay, so I'll not discuss on that. Is you have your English also to to um, English subjects to really delve on that. Okay, so again, paraphrase lang mas maayo. L less lang ang gamit sa direct quotes. And that is. Uh, basically, that's it for in-text citation. Inside the text na citation. Mm -hmm. And it was very well discussed there, eh? no? Sa kanang video about in-text citation. And since we're done with in-text citations, let's go to reference citations. Reference citations, mao ni siyang dapat na. Ah. Kung sa in-text, author date lang na. Ah. For, um, for your references, Na ang author, date, na ang title of the work, and same time with the source where you got your um your uh, idea. Okay, and so let us have no for example here. Can sensitivity to evaluation of others? Moni siyang journal ang kana, di ba? So sa kaniya journal, this is a research paper, guys. So sa kaniya research paper. And I am discussing journals because this is a very practical, and this is what we um, usually, especially in this time of the pandemic, um, our uh, literature review more on journals. So that's why it's important that we know. Okay, in this journal, the title is this one. Okay, so the title: Authors Sarah Valanciabodo and Philip Rocha or Rocha. sila yung pronounce. And then source, we're gonna retrieve the work. This is the source developmental psychology. And then I okay, um, na I volume and volume and the number and then DOI, okay, or data object identifier, okay. As in a data object identifier, pick lang na ako ano. Fun fact, DOIs, um, these are assigned no, by uh, the American Association of the Research uh, Committee, committee um, and they give data object identifier to all mga works, no? researches ba na, or books, or um, whatever nga mga ma-retrieve di mo online, so that na ay number nga assign it's easy for you to find that. Okay, that's it. Now, Let's, um, so, Monisha, if web page lang, and then individual author, so that's how you are going to do it. If web page and then group author, that's how. If journal, alt, journal article with one author, this is how you're gonna do it. Because if you notice, most of the works that stand alone, okay, and then works that are part of a greater whole, ang kani works that stand alone, kanang mga books, nga, that's it. Wala sila ay volume number, no uh, volume and then no, number, no? Ang parts of a greater whole usually unsay may atong indication ana journals na siya kasagaran guys ang kaning parts of a whole kay diri makita ka no volume 54 so sa una na ay volume 53 52 of course <laughs> logically di ba and then sa volume 54 ika number 9 is siya so na pay number 10 11 12 this kani siya is part of a greater whole that is why part siya sa works that are part of a greater whole ang imong i-italize Italics. Ang imo italics kaya ang source name. Pero, if works that's not alone, mga newspaper, news articles, um, books, e-books, title of the work. So, kintahay ka ni, ni Tom Kids, Cognitive Behavior Therapy, mo na title sa iyang libro. And then, diretso na yun, oh, kabate ka, wala siya volume number, on sa panang mga volume number, and the number, wala. No? Stand alone na siya. But, since kita katagal ng journal, pwede ang itong mga sources, ang itong i-italicized kay dili ang assessing, dili ang title, but the what? The source. Okay, healthcare 6. Oh, italicized na siya. Like, kani siya. Um, developmental psychology 54. Italicized na siya. So, if you notice here, tara. Okay? And, ano siya, comma, and then, kana, italicized in the number, comma, page number, period, and then, the, D-O-I. So, that is it. That's really what you need to remember. No, so, if it's one, one author, kana, that's how you do that. If two authors, again, ampersand, gihapon siya, guys. And then, if 
um, more than that than this one. Okay? So, mo na siya, last name, and then the initials of the first name of the authors, and then the year. Okay? So, technically, that's it. Follow that, and then you will be um, on the right track. So, technically, that's uh, the difference uh, uh, in text citation within the text, and then reference citation kay at the end. So, ang in text na adiris sa body of text, no, makita din ha ang mga citation like this. Mills of 2007, ang mga siya mga in text citation, manay parenthetical and narrative na style, no, how to do that. And then, makita na dayon ang reference citation at the end. So, the match. Every index citation na I match nga reference list citation. Thank you so much for listening to this very quick um, review on and um, review sa ato ang APA 7th edition nga index citation and reference citation. I'll see you everybody, um, students, and then uh, on our um, the virtual online classes and stay safe, stay healthy. Bye guys!